Hi, and welcome to Odyssey of Ascension. This is Roxanne once again. Thanks for tuning in, and let's go on to, uh, let's go on to what? <laughs> let's get on with channeling. <laughs> <laughs> let's go on to the show. <laughs> oh, yeah, thank you again, really, seriously, for tuning in. I love you guys. All right, here we go. There's going to be a slight delay because the cat is uh, wanting to come in. They can always turn the button off and then start again and nobody will ever know that the cat... Yeah, but that's fun though. It's okay. like behind the it's scenes. It's like you're right there with us, right? Yeah, you're like, you guys are right there with <laughs> us. And watch, I'm going to grab my coffee. <laughs> you're so professional. I know, I'm, I'm such a pro. Coffee. <laughs> oh god, that's good. Don't you love it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do that. Crazy. Okay, close up. <laughs> close up. <laughs> okay, read his back. Ah. Oh. Great. Now I'm not gonna stop laughing. I'll try to be good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're done next <laughs> Yeah. Alright, here we go. And greetings once again to the collective. This is Osiphius. I bid you a good day. Hmm. All right, here we go. Let us journey again. We have an idea of where we're going to go and come along if you choose. We are going back to the idea of the frequency highway and let's see who pops in. Truly, stand by. Thanks for showing up. Thanks for connecting to us. Appreciate it. Very nice. Very nice of you. Very nice. Very nice of you to come to the show. Very, very nice of you guys to show up, so to speak, and bring us idealizing this nice impartation, this nice connection. Motivation. Let's speak of that. Motivation. Hmm. I'm going to give you an idea, humanity, and we want you to look at this from a perspective of emptiness. Hmm? From, from, from no perspective. Be as nothing as you can. Hmm? First off, we'd like to tell you we're very funny up here. We love humor. Humor is excellent. However, humanity, you might be missing a little bit of a point behind humor. Humor is a way of we, us, up here, in frequency, idea higher than your own vibration, to connect with you. It's light-hearted, but it sinks deep. We are very, very serious about our humor. Truly. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Here's what we want to give you behind motivation that has to do with that. Hmm? We're funny, but we're very seriously funny. But your definition of serious hmm, is a construct behind it. It means you can't be funny. You can't joke around. You need to focus. Hmm? Think about it. But truly, humor is a way, seriously, to communicate. Now, I want you to look at serious, and now I want you to connect it to motivation. Okay? 
those two vibrational constructs. This is not over your head. Journey with us. Allow yourself nothing. Listen, when you're motivated, ask yourself why you're motivated. Hmm? Is it, ah, yeah. <sighs> sorry, is it because you want to achieve? Is it because you want to achieve? Achievement has an ending. Oops. Achievement has a finite ending. There is no ending. Motivation, human construct motivation, is equal to your idea of serious. You take all of your fun out of it and focus motivation. It's the same construct, the same vibration core that's limited. Motivation. Now, our serious is humor to connect with you because it, let's say, pa by bypasses, bypasses, bypasses your, your filters. Because it's natural to be funny, to be having a good time. So it's easy to connect through the means of humor. But our humorous ways are serious. Your serious is connected to scoping your reality and taking your reality in a motivational, forward-moving fashion to achieve to formulate a goal, to formulate an outcome, to formulate a status. From a different space-time now, motivation, true motivation, has no meaning behind it. It is creation in and of itself equal equal to will, your willpower, but not your thrusting of willpower because you want to achieve. No, you're all the time in the now, driving force, creation of yourself, willpower is true motivation. The construct of the human mind catches up to motivation. The idea of limitation within the construct of the human mind is a formulated motivation. There's two different things here. When you get serious, you're motivated because you're keeping away your fun. Now, we're very serious about communicating with you. So we're funny when we do it. Truly, we love laughter. We love communicating with you. We love offering our perspectives. It is our motivation with no, zero, nada, tipota, venejo. Motivation, outcome. We don't want the outcome. There is no outcome. Outcome takes you out of the now. You cannot have an outcome. You have a dream. The dream creates itself with motivation. The dream does not need to be serious. Don't take yourself so serious. Those are to the Syrians. Let them. Not you. Be motivated with no motivation. Be serious with humor. Create your idea self out of the will of the now. The now creates motivation in the idea of the potentiator. Your higher self says, I love you. 
fractal. Your higher self says, I want to give you my fractal self. So I give you motivation, pure, clean, empty, waiting to be filled by you with your choices, your own idea of yourself, your own thought processes of your filtered ideas of creation, of reality, of ideally what you are to you. That is motivation. Do not conjure up motivation. You are not, not original thought. You can't be. Your mind does not have original thought. You cannot conjure motivation from a dead past. The past is nothing. It's references to understand the unknown when the potentiator, your higher self, presents it to you. It is a reference point to move into the unknown through your own bravery, through your own isness, through your own idea of yourself. We are very serious about creating with humanity. But we would like you to not look at it in your definition of serious. Because your definition of serious motivates you to create out of the past, only giving you a new version of what you've experienced. The will, the I am, the core being, the isness of all, you, the fractal idea of all that is, the particle of information you are, the thought of the thought of the Creator, all of that, that whole idea has its own built-in motivation. It needs no help from you. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. It needs no direction. No, no, it knows. It knows all. It needs no, let's say, enticing. None. Zero. It is already running full bore out. It is running top speed already. It is running past you when you are motivating from the idea of the past, of an achievement, of an outcome. Live now! Live now! Be now! There is nothing. There is nothing greater. To explore the unknown, not shrouding it with the past, giving you distorted views of reality, distorted ideas of what is, reminiscence of the past. Your memory is a reference to step forward into the unknown. That is what your memory does for you. Do not rely upon it. Because you will only spin yourself in circles. You will only repeat your lives until you understand, coalesce, turn idea beliefs into wisdom. In that one journey of the self, when that happens, you will move forward. True. We are honored. Thank you for allowing us to come. Ekama is my name. I guess it's my turn. Greetings to that of humanity, and we are honored once again to co-create with you. We have found the idea connection through our travels, and we are most honored to, let's say, be a part of this now. My name, you have maybe remember me, some of you, maybe not, it is Gongolina. I am from what you call your Terrapian civilization. You understand that term. 
the true frequency sound is like inaudible, inaudible to your, let's say, tones you are familiar with in this now. So Terrapian civilization will work, most certainly. We are that of your idealized trees, that is your connection to us. We are part of your harmonious antennae through all your idea landscape to connect the idea ley lines and grid lines and your telepathic ideas of connection to each other and we are all the time speaking with you. We are whisperers to many of you who are choosing to connect with us and you listen and hear our chatter. Many times you chalk it up to what you would understand as your mind running amok. Truly, it may be your mind running amok distorted what we are chatting about. You may not understand it fully, it may be staticky, but most certainly it is being connected if you trust your own intuition of the voices that you hear in your head. And fear nothing, you are not going insane. What truly you are is connecting to more frequencies that are about you all the time. And a very, very powerful, strong one is your idea tree connection of the, of the Terrapian civilization. And me, the speaker of this civilization, your ambassador, if you will, would I be Gongalina. You may call upon us and ask your questions. We have many, many answers, many ideas. We do not play in the idea much, if you will, on when things are going to happen in timeline probabilities. We are more interested in connections between your portals and the way you can travel and connect with those portals, as well as your other idealized Earths about you that are not within your frequency band range to notice them truly. The idea like your Middle Earth, your civilizations about you, and you all know them as your fairy tales and your magical ideas. We are very much connected and you may connect us with us rather through that idea means speak my name Gongalena and we will connect. Once again this is a offering to those who choose to connect Dream with us, walk with us, talk with us, play with us, we are here. It is our honor, once again, humanity, to co-create with you. I bid you a good day. And greeting once again, this is Osiphi. Yes. This is all we have for this space time now. It is our honor once again to co-create with you, and we, let's say, love that you've chosen to come along and ride the frequency highway once again with us. I bid you a good day. I don't. Cool beans. Ah, oh, goodness. Whew. Hot. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for...